Hey, what's up my Koopatroop? It's Koops and welcome guys to another episode of One Piece Treasure Cruise. We're now doing the Great Pursuit Close Chase. This is Smoker. I think, are they calling him Chaser here? I don't think so. I think they're still calling him Smoker. But it's Close Chase. I just realized I had never shown this one off before. It's not a super great event and in fact I don't need Smoker whatsoever. But by a great event I mean you don't really... I mean Smoker's a very very good character. You need to get him because he's just super strong. But personally for me, I don't need him because I have him like already maxed out. I'm going to be running Kuma as my captain, but I found a friend with a new Blackbeard who boosts strength characters by 2.5 and HP by 2.25, but doubles damage taken. However, this is a super tanky team. Eventually, I'm going to replace Kuma on my team with Blackbeard myself, but my Blackbeard is very low leveled and not evolved. So that's why I'm not running Blackbeard. I'll be running Kuma. All right, as you can see... This team has 82,000 HP. You read that correctly, 82,000 HP. Uh, they're pretty strong. <laughs> and they do lots of damage. Well, decent damage right now, I suppose. So we'll take out Smoker there in one turn. That's the first Smoker. There's gonna be more Smokers to come, I have a feeling. All right, straight through everyone there. I'm not gonna be stalling or anything like that. We're just gonna be running through. Now there are gonna be some blue characters, so I'm not sure running a strength team is actually the best idea. Maybe a slasher team is a little bit smarter. All right, see what Tsushigi does. Yeah, 7,800 damage. That's kind of a lot, but we don't. Oh, that's right. I don't want to heal because I can't. <laughs> My team can't heal because we have old Mega Chopper back there who doesn't like to heal very much because he can't. <laughs> Actually, she might do damage to me again. I'm kind of trolling here a little bit. I should do a little bit better job of aiming and use the right characters at the right time. All right, so that was her first special. Her second one didn't do that much damage. Man, I'm just getting all blue orbs here. Kind of annoying. Yeah, taking a look at this again, I actually hadn't done this this event, so I didn't know what to expect, but I would say maybe running all strength is not the right idea. As Tashibi was pretty obnoxious there. Slow going. Of course, I still have 68,000 HP, so we are chugging along. Now, I can't heal. I can't heal up at all. As you probably all saw before. But not really a big deal. Lots of HP still left in the tank. Man, I love Kuma's animation. It's probably one of the better sound effects in the whole series and game and everything. I just love it. It's so so satisfying. Dang, that guy tanky. Actually, I'm gonna see if we can save orbs here. I'm not trying to slow down the game. I don't know if I I don't know if Smoker takes orbs or anything like that. I, I actually haven't played this one. Alright, so I'm gonna go all the way through. Okay. I got one of them. I actually don't need to worry about my other guy now because he can change his orb himself. It's always a really nice ability that he can do that. Damn, more blues, huh? I'm still looking here for red orbs. All right, one more chance to look. Okay, all yellow. That is surprising. All right, now it's time for the boss, Smoker himself. Got you. Wiped out. Ow, ow, ow. Smoker, you jerk. You locked my guy for four, tur four turns. Didn't know that was going to happen, but cool. It happened. All right, so let's just do as much damage as we possibly can. I'm not going to change my orb just yet. I'm not getting that huge damage boost from having my both captains, so... Or not huge damage boost, but damage boost. So I'm gonna wait, especially for him to get like a blue orb or something like that. Oh, I missed that? That's uh, surprising. Also, Kumi got his special, nice. So when he gets unlocked, which I'm hoping he gets unlocked. No, there's no way I missed that. That makes me so sad. Okay, he's not doing anything, it seems like, so. This would be a lot easier if I wasn't 
trolling so hard here. And actually hitting perfects. Alright, finally he's unlocked. I think it's time for the floodgates to open. And we can do all this damage. So, okay, this team does work. It's a little slow going. I'm sure there's a lot better teams to make it work out. Let's have fun doing this one. I'm gonna have fun using all my specials, man. Smoker was punishing me for a little while. But as you can see, we still end up with 43,000 HP, so we're not, like, anywhere close to dying by any means. Boom! Give ourselves some more red orbs, and I think it's high time Smoker dies. Kumo with the fi finishing blow. He actually dropped two. Killing weaklings like you is no fun. Yeah, so a little bit overkill at the end. So, yeah, Smoker didn't really pose much of a threat when you have that much HP. Kind of nice. So, like I said, not a great team comp, but it will do the trick in a pinch. So, as for why this event kind of sucks, you can see right here why it sucks. Look what I got dropped. This is about the best thing you're going to get to drop. And it's Zeph's book, which... Zeph used to be the leader for fighters because he had 2.5 times, but now you're just going to use Jinbei if you wanted to do that. And no one uses Jinbei as a captain anyways. Toshigi, who is a blue slasher, but not a very good one. You'd rather use the new blue Zoro, the Halloween one, the blue Brook, or uh, the blue... What's his face? I just forgot. Uh, Luchi, yeah. Any of those are better options than Tashiki. I suppose if you want another blue slasher, you could have that one, but... Yeah. Oh, also, and uh, what's his face? Cat out of the bag guy. Captain... Kuro. Yes. So, yeah, there's a lot of other blue slashers. You don't want Tashiki. And the rest is just junk, really. Smoker's good. You want Smoker, and... In fact, if you can max Smoker, you definitely... That's a good thing to do. He is one of the more powerful characters in the game. And he starts off as a baby smoker down here. I'm going to call him baby smoker. You got to go all the way up to 50 to evolve him into, like, white hunter smoker or something. And then you got to go up to 99 to evolve him again to biker smoker or white chase smoker. Whatever. It doesn't matter. You guys know what I'm talking about. This guy's good, but you can see his HP is 22, attack 12 and maxes out at 15 turns. Okay, he's good, and he's definitely strong and worth getting because of the damage reduction. But nowadays, as the power levels keep creeping up, he gets surpassed in damage and HP, you know, quite often. Where he used to be, I mean, he's not bad by any means, but in HP, I mean, he's surpassed by so many other characters, even though he's max level already. Like, already all these new guys are so much stronger HP-wise. And attack... Well, definitely good for me. 1282 is, like, that's nothing to sneeze at. So, yeah, in that sense, he's still pretty good. But obviously, I have still have a lot of characters that will surpass him in attack. I just haven't leveled them all up all the way yet. You know, um, decent more characters that will surpass him there, too. So, good character, worth getting. Eventually, he's getting beat up by a couple other characters, but is good for the time being. So, go ahead and get them. All right, guys, that's the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time for more One Piece Treasure Cruise. Till then, take it easy. Peace.